Hello channel friends, this is W Copeland 38. Today I'm going to be doing a field strip on a Smith & Wesson MP40 compact. Okay, here's the gun. Okay, we're going to go through, do our safety check, lock it open, remove the magazine, Magazine's empty. Check inside. Nothing there. And nothing there. So looks like we're pretty good to go. Okay. I'm going to put the magazine back in. Release. Point in a safe direction. A dry fire. Okay. Now let's get started. Okay. Now this is your takedown lever. And that's the main thing we have to worry about. And there's one other part that's inside here that I have to rotate. And I'm going to go over that with you. Okay, first thing I'm going to do is we'll lock it back. Okay, remove the magazine. Take that out. Next step is there's a rod in here. I'm going to have to turn on the little light so you can see inside there. There we go. There's a little rod sticks right up and it's right about here can't see it there okay see the little rod with the elbow on it that has to be rotated down when it when it's in there it's up straight against flush up against the back end of the gun and they in the uh, Instructions they tell you to take this out and use it. Well, trying to get that thing out is a big pain in the butt. So I either use the end of a pan or I'm just using a uh, letter opener right now for speed. Okay. Now with that down, now you move the takedown lever. You rotate it all the way down. This one on this gun is extremely stiff. Wait, give me just a second. Like I said, the one on this gun is extremely stiff. We got that down. Whoop, pop back up. There. I'm going to hold that with this hand. Release the slide. And off she comes. Okay. That's all set. You have the slide assembly, recoil spring, and the barrel. Okay, good to go there. Now, take out the recoil spring. It almost lifts right out. It's not under a whole lot of tension, just enough. I'm going to slide the barrel assembly up, move it out. There's the top, bottom, and the rest for the recoil spring. Okay, you would go through and do the appropriate cleaning, get whatever done you need to get done and properly lubricate it. If you want me to go over uh, lubrication areas, I'll do that in another video because I don't want to take too long on these. Okay, reassembly, same thing in reverse. Drop in the barrel, get it seated. Recall spring, goes back in the same way it came out. Get it down in. Okay, we're in and we're good to go. Now, Putting the gun back together, put the slide on, slide all the way up, and the takedown spring, the takedown lever actually pops itself right back into place. You don't, I, on this gun, I don't uh, even have to worry about folding back up. It, it locks itself back in. The gun's reassembled. Put the magazine back in. Of course, it's still empty. Let's check it one more time. Let's release it. Dry fire in a safe area. And that's pretty much it. The most difficult part on this particular gun is trying to get the uh, takedown lever to actually stay down. And you remember on the inside, 
it's got that little lever with the elbow in it that has to be moved down in order to get the uh, slide to come all the way off. And that is how you do a field strip on a Smith & Wesson MP40 Compact. Thank you very much. Have a good day and keep your guns clean.